How to fix VMware S problem hyperthreading unmitigated. To fix VMware S problem hyperthreading unmitigated, try one of the following tips. 1. Update vCenter. There are three ways to update VMware vCenter server appliance, vcsa one Using the VAMI interface The VAMI interface is a web-based interface that you can use to manage your vcsa. To update your vcsa using the VAMI interface, follow these steps. 1. Open a web browser and navigate to the VAMI IP address. 2. Log into the VAMI using the default credentials, username, root, password, password. 3. Click on the system tab. 4. Click on the software updates link. 5. Click on the check for updates button. 6. If there are any updates available. Updates button. 7. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the update. Subsource, patching, update. VMware vCenter Server Appliance vCSA and Platform Service Controller PSC through Appliance Management Interface VAMI 84322 VMware KB 2 Using the Update Manager the Update Manager is a VMware product that you can use to manage and update your VMware infrastructure. To update your VCSA using the Update Manager, follow these steps. 1. Log into the Update Manager console. 2. Select the VCSA that you want to update. 3. Click on the Patches and Updates tab. 4. Click on the Check for Updates button. 5. If there are any updates available, click on the Install Updates button. 6. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the update. 3. Using the command line you can also update your VCSA using the command line. To do this, you will need to use the following command, VAMI update this command will check for updates and install them if they are available. It is important to note that you should always back up your VCSA before updating it. This will help you to restore your VCSA to its previous state if the update process fails or if the update causes problems with your VCSA. Here are some additional tips for updating your VCSA, asterisk make sure that you are using the latest version of the VAMI interface or the update manager. Asterisk back up your VCSA before updating it. Asterisk only update your VCSA when it is not in use. Asterisk monitor your VCSA after updating it to make sure that it is working properly. If you have any questions about updating your VCSA, you can contact VMware support for help. 2. Change the value of the ES11 advanced option user bars. Suppress hyperthread warning from 0 to 1. Refer to the IMG below. Path. Configure system advanced system settings edit filter by user bars. Suppress and find user bars. Suppress thread warning. Source. L1TF related s. Problem. Hyperthreading. Unmitigated. vCenter server updates. CVE 2018 3646 57374.